Hey guys, welcome back to Your Lottery's Magic World Let's Play. This is episode 28. I have done a bit of monster hunting at night. Got myself um, some more Enderman kills. And some Ender Pearls. Hopefully I can finish this research we were working on. And you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna switch my boots too, because these things can be annoying in the in the house. Gotta take my outside boots off. How many of these is it gonna burn through to get this research done? Come on, finish. Wanna have some good seven left. Alright. Magic mirror. And I don't have my Thumbonomicon on me. You are now able to enchant a pair of magical mirrors that act as doorways to the void between the worlds. Anything shoved through the one mirror will pass through the, this realm and exit the other mirror, even across dimensional boundaries. Unfortunately, this realm is extremely hostile to mortal creatures like yourself, so using these mirrors to transport living creatures is not yet possible. To link a pair of these magical mirrors, you simply need to place one of them in the desired location. You then right-click with a second mirror on the one you placed, and the pair will become linked. Every 16 items you transmit will consume one vis. One vis. So to make them, you need to make... Um, Mirrored glass with glass planes and quicksilver and visum and vitreous. And then you need to take four of those. Oh, and a portable hole. So I need more ender pearls and some gold. Now, I think there's another thing to research in this line. Got something there. Unknown theory. Hooray for unknown theories. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. It's always comes down to let's try to guess what it needs. Um, uh, tell them. Um, carrots. Yes. Magic hand mirror. So yes, there is another one in the line. Uh, it's probably going to take Ender Pearls. So we might as well suck it up and... three more things. I'm so glad my sword had looting to get those pearls because I almost died from those things. They're so powerful. Let's try redstone. Didn't think so. Um, trap door. Probably going to have to make more of these. Yep. All right, let's make some more trapdoors. Mm. 
liking that inventory tweaks thing. The middle mouse button to spread everything around. Okay, now we have two left. Um, probably some kind of tool. Yep. Oh, and seeds too. for these. Oh, let's put these away. And get some lint. Discovery Magic Hand Mirror. So you take a magic mirror and a wand and 16 in instrumentum and it gives you a portable mirror. Probably pretty handy for sending stuff back to a chest. Larger expenditure of vis to transport them. Alright, so I um, wonder if there's anything else we can learn. I don't like the way it just burns stuff and doesn't when you don't have a, anything researched it should like burn stuff like it should like gray stuff out when you can't research something does that make sense I think so okay guess research is done for now let's make uh, one of these reliquary things uh, we'll put this stuff away first that away. I want to make... I heard there was a gun. Yes, so I want to make a hunter's handgun. And it requires iron, a slime ball, and some parts. So let's make a barrel. Okay, magma creams, ender pearls. <laughs> oh god, ender pearls. Uh, magma cream. Okay, so I need three magma creams. Two ender pearls. I can make mag magma creams. Did I use all of my? No, I do have ender pearls. Good. All right, let's make this handgun. Um, magma cream. Pulverize that to get more out of it. Yes. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Some iron. And first thing we're going to make is the barrel, which is a magma cream, two ender pearls, and some iron. Cool, cool, cool. 
Next thing we're going to make is the hammer assembly, which oh, I need a blaze rod. And I just used my blaze rod. Okay, so we're going to hit the nether. Wait for a blaze to spawn. Come on, Blaze. Hmm, there's one. Awesome. Got three Blaze Rods. Thank you, Looting. There's another one. Let's get him, too. He's not coming. Good enough. Nice quick trip. Okay, so we need a play oh we need a magma cream first. Magma cream, blaze rod, iron, we need a button. I don't have a button. Hold on. Hold your horses. Button, magma cream, blaze rod, iron. Next we need a grip assembly, which is a blaze cream and a magazine. A magazine needs glass and stone. A couple stone here. And a glass. That makes five magazines, wow. All right, magazine. Um, magma cream magazine. There we go. And then we can make this. For some reason, it thinks I don't have all the ingredients. There we go. Handgun get. And then there's different um There's different ammunitions you can make. These are empty magazines. Hmm. I wonder if that means that the gun starts out empty. Yep. All right, I need ammo. Ammo. Bullet. There we go. Now there's different kinds. Let's just make this kind. It needs gold nuggets, stone, iron, and gunpowder. Make, how much does it make? Four. Makes four. I need eight to load up a magazine. Hmm. It's called shot, so let's let's see if there's other kinds. Oh yeah, look, there's tons. Exorcism, blaze, ender, concussion, buster, seeker, sand. Good against creepers. Okay, so they I need to start with the with the regular kind. Um let's make a whole bunch. And we need uh, stone, approximately 32 stone, and we need some nuggets, 
me get rid of some of this extra stuff here. I'm going to need 64 nuggets, aren't I? So, Wow, this takes a lot of gold. Okay, bullets. Recipe, make. There we go, 64 bullets. Let's load up a magazine. Now how do I load my gun with it? Craft it with the magazine? Or I just click to reload? Apparently I just right click to reload. Pew pew! Alright, let's make some of these sand shots too. I can't remember how to make them. That was right. Sand, oh, sandstone. Tricky, tricky. Spinning around. go and we'll load those into a magazine now how do can I switch magazines or do you just have to carry a different ammo type let's load these up with regulars All right, let's uh, let's go test this thing out. Go find something to shoot. We're like morning, so there's probably not going to be much to shoot. But you never know. Maybe I'll shoot a squid. Ooh, meat. Let's see what it looks like. Hmm. Can I shoot a bush? So it's, uh, I don't know, it looks kind of cool. I wonder what it looks like if I shoot. Shoot. Cool. Alright, wow, it uses ammo fast. I guess it's to be expected, one bullet per shot. So we have a gun. A magical gun. What's next on the agenda? How's this thing? Why? Okay, it's charging. It was, um, something was really wacky going on with this redstone energy cell. All my machines were off. I wasn't using any energy. This one was full. And this one had got up to like 4,000 and some MJs. And I went off to the desert at night killing stuff. And when I came back, this was at 3,000 and climbing. So it just it like lost energy or something. I don't know what exactly is going on. All right, 
that's put oh look I got empty casings how do I use those craft them back into gold nuggets so it takes um, you get all your gold back but you burn the iron and gunpowder and stone so that's cool at least you get your gold back oops that doesn't go there Next on the agenda is um, what do I what do I want to do next? Drink some of my cappuccino. Okay. Um, more reliquary stuff. What else can I make? Something with the glass vials or the Midas stone, maybe, or. Um, I wonder if these um, potions you can make stack. So let's make some vials. So we need some glass. Oh, pardon me. Big sneeze. Okay, the files, empty files only stacked to, six, to 16, it looks like. Um, I guess we have to fill them with water. They do stack when they're full of water. I hear my chicken thing going off again. That's cool. All right, and what can we use these for? Can make solvent for potions and splash serum. Okay, these make cool elixirs. So let's, um, netherwort, redstone, and glowstone. I'm going to make eight of these, I think. Cool. And then we're going to make um, eight or seven of the other one, which is gunpowder instead of redstone. Um, gunpowder. All right, next up, what can we do with the splash one? So we can make glowing water, which destroys undead and used in recipes. Love potions, poison, acid. Confusion, slowing, weakness, wither, blinding and fertilizer. Okay, so we're going to make the glowing ones, I think. Well, we're going to see what we can make with it. Exorcism shot with ammo. Coin of fortune, that's cool, but I need eyes of ender. I uh, don't really care about something that batches undead. I have a sword with smite on it. Holy hand grenade, that's cool, but boy does it take a lot. That might be neat. I could make that. Blaze rod, mango creams. Can't make that, no wither stars. Oh look at that, you can 
That is interesting. You can take one nether star and make two nether stars. The tomb of Alcast. You make glowing bread too. That's really interesting. What can you use this to do then? Wow, diamonds into a dragon egg. Now there's a person dragon egg to make an outcast. Redstone and dirt to make dirt. So this thing's like the um the philosopher's stone in equivalent exchange. Redstone to make extra cobble. Except I think so far it looks to be a little bit better balanced. Um because you're unless there's a way of making redstone because with the equivalent exchange you can just put tons of cobble in and make anything it was pretty ridiculous I mean it took lots of cobble but I mean you could make anything this lets you duplicate something but you need to consume redstone to do it that one might be handy four lapis blocks to make a diamond. That's, I think that's pretty reasonable. Four redstone to make a gunpowder. Yeah, it's like, it's not cheap. All right, so what were we gonna make again? We were gonna make the, um, the this thing sojourner staff so I need gold I need two magma creams I need a blaze rod one blaze rod let's get rid of that thing two magma creams right some gold. Can't remember how much. And uh, glowstone. Glowstone, glowstone. Oh, I have glowstone. All right. So we need two of these. Like this, like this, like this, I don't know. Oh, okay, magma cream's up there, and then gold all around. Oh, and you get the vials back, that's cool. So, this thing consumes torches. And you see it sucked up my torches from that spot already, so it looks like it does that automatically. So we'll put it right there, and we're going to make a whole bunch of torches. So we're going to need a stack of charcoal, and a bunch of wood. Oh, where did I put it? I do that all the time. I put stuff down at the bottom instead of into my inventory. There we go, stack of sticks. Oh, look at them sucked into it. Awesome. It's loading it up. Cool, I can hold some more. Let's make some more. Hold some more, make some more. Hmm.
cool, cool, cool. Sweet. All right, that's good enough. Let's make something else. Now I can like place torches at a distance. Watch this. Watch this. We'll, uh, where do we need a torch? Let's put one over here. Isn't that awesome? Now it consumes more torches to do that. But I think it's pretty neat. Okay, we were going to make some potions with these. Like uh, speed would be neat. Digging might be neat. Strength. Ooh, elixir of healing. Glistering melon and two glowstone. Jumping, regeneration. Hmm, that's nice too. Fire warding, that might be handy. I don't know which to make. Alright, we're going to make the healing ones. We're going to make four of them anyway. So we need glowstone and glistering melon, which is gold nuggets. Melons. Mel oh, I've got a couple here already. Cool. Cool, they stack. Awesome, 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 awesome. Yeah, I'm liking these potions. Uh, I don't know which has to make though, so I'm gonna I'm gonna leave them for now. But I think I need a chest just for potions. Um. Chest, chest, chest. Do I have any made? Don't think I do. All right. Okay, guys. Um I think that's all the, of the reliquary stuff I'm going to do right now. Uh so I'm going to call it an end to this episode. Next time, I think I'm going to go back to doing some building. Um, I might do a little bit off camera. Uh, I'm going to work on the farming area a bit, make it start to look more like a village. At some point, I think I want to move some villagers over there, but I need to make sure it's kind of zombie-proofed first and that they have a place to live. Uh, so I'll probably do a little bit off camera um, and then... Uh, show you what I have and build some more for next episode. Thanks for watching. This has been your Lottery's Magic World Let's Play. Uh, see you soon. Bye.